United Way Southern Nevada is back with the program that provides assistance to seniors experiencing economic hardship with past due utility bills. Here to share more on Project Reach Senior Expos are Samuel Rudd with, uh, with UWSN and Angel Williams with NV Energy. Good morning Good to morning. you guys. Good morning. Good morning. How are you guys feeling this morning? Wonderful. Excellent. Good. So uh, Samuel, uh, there, there are multiple expos coming up. You know, how do they all help and, and what are the differences between some of them and, and, and how, they, how, how are you able to deal with all these different things going on? Yes, we have four expos um, annually in August and the, the Project, Reach Nevada, uh, Project Reach Senior Expos are powered by NB Energy and it's a great partnership that we have that helps seniors that have limited resources with their past due utility bill. We have one tomorrow that's at Samstown and then two more next week um, in various locations and the best way to get that information is to go to uwsn.org slash senior expo. Right. Now we know that there's a lot of people in our community that need some help right now. Why are these expos so vital to our community? You know, this is so important because we want to ensure that during the hot summer months, the, the seniors of our community have the support they need, especially those with limited resources. And it's really important that as a community, we come together and recognize that we have people who have need and people that can help with that need. And that's the, the reason United Way is here, is to help make that bridge and ensure that we support the, 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 our community in the best way possible. Yeah, you, you talked about it, Samuel, about everyone coming together and acting as a community. And, and Angel, obviously that's clearly important to MV Energy being mm -hmm. part of this. You know, yes. what, why is it essential for you as an organization to, to get involved and be there and give back? It's part of the core values of NV Energy and our foundation, and we received feedback directly from our customers saying that this is an area where we need help. And so we're able to partner with great organizations like United Way to help produce these four expos. We rally, you know, on average about 60 different employees that come and volunteer their time at these expos, really connecting those seniors on the spot to that critical resource. Now, Samuel, where uh, are the expos taking place? There's a few of them going on. Yes, so the next one is tomorrow at Samstown, and then next week at New Orleans and um, uh, all the Aliante Casino. Yeah, yeah and, and with those expos, the seniors that might be watching at home, we have a number of viewers, obviously, I'm sure, who are listening up or are concerned about their neighbors or, or family members. Are, are there certain qualifications for seniors involved in these programs? They have to hit a certain quota or a certain level of what they owe or what they, their income or retirement plan is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Um, seniors need to be age 62 or older. Uh, bring proof of income. Um, that can be paycheck stub, it can be a bank statement, any documented proof of income. And if you can't find that, we will have Social Security there that can pull up Social Security benefits for seniors and that can serve as proof of income. And then you just have to have a past due utility bill. Um, and then you can, once you arrive on site, you can make your choice on which utility bill you'd like to have paid. Angel, yeah. you spoke on the significance and importance mm -hmm. of being part of these expos, but why is it really meaningful to, to, for you and for the company overall to lend a hand in this? Yeah. Well, we know that you know, during the summer months, our customers are experiencing some of their highest utility bills you know, because of that heat and that air conditioning running. And so we know when we can help connect seniors to you know, some economic relief, that gives them the ability to you know, handle other expenses um, in their household. And, and takes away that economic burden of that higher utility bill in the summer. Yeah, I, I, certainly I, th I think everyone's feeling the crunch right now. You know, people are, are, are making decisions on what things to cut from their budgets, what things to prioritize, and seniors are always the most, well, one of the most vulnerable groups in our community. Mm -hmm. So this is an impressive thing to do. Uh, are, are there any things that people should bear in mind about the expos? You know, are, are there wait times? You know, do, do these get super packed? Is it really easy and quickly, you know, these seniors can get through here? Yeah, we do service about 600 seniors at each expo, so we'll be hoping to, to serve over 2,100 to 2,600 seniors through the full month. And so they will come, we will have a group of volunteers from a variety of organizations that will be there to assist them. It's a, ver it worked, it's a very streamlined process, um, but there is a process to walk through. In addition to that, um, if, if the events do not work out for individuals to come, we also provide this same service throughout the year through a variety of nonprofit partners 
partners. And again, uh, you can go to uwsn.org slash senior expos to see that list in case these events don't, don't work out. Well, this is a great initiative in our community. So thank you so much for joining us this morning and sharing all about it. Thanks, guys. Thanks great. for having me. Thank Seniors you. in our community who are looking for more information on eligibility requirements, the application, and upcoming expos, be sure to visit uwsn.org slash senior expos.